Hey guys, so it's been one month since I, well, three weeks since I haven't posted. And everybody like, with the funeral, with the, with the this, with the that. So I'm finally going to update all them on the funeral and thing. So first of all, there is no funeral. Ow. There is no funeral because Aaron was cremated Sunday going. Mm -hmm. He was cremated and I had to watch my brother through a phone screen while he was cremated. Mm -hmm. Not in real life, you know, through a phone screen while my mommy was up there crying, bawling. The words can't explain how I feel. I swear. Imagine watching your own sibling cremate through a phone screen. Through a phone screen. I don't want to cry, I don't want to cry, I don't want to cry. But anyways, that happened because let me give all you. Let me explain all it. Let me explain to all what really went on. So when he ran died, he went to a funeral home in Nashville, Tennessee. And mommy got the number, you know. And stuff and thing. So when she called, the man was like, he would take care of Aaron, he wouldn't know. You know the normal thing that's doing funeral homes and stuff. So week one pass, my mommy called, he was like, he would send down the body. Week two pass in January, he said, mommy called, he said he would send it down. Week three, the man gets sick, just so he had family problems. So my mother finally was strange because three weeks now you can't send your own body. And every week when she call, is a different, it's just something new. It's just something pop, it's just something. Either he papers, either something or something. So week four now, which was last week, she decided to take a plane and go, you know, to the place. So when she reach, when she reach, and the man asks, who is this? And my mommy was like, this is Aaron's mother. He was so shocked. The man did not do nothing on Aaron. He left Aaron there. And if my mommy didn't go up, he was going to leave Aaron there for two to three months. He was not going to send down Aaron. So my mother was just, my mother just cried when she returned because all you had to say was that you couldn't do the work or just this or just that, but no, you just lied. And you have people here grieving, waiting for Aaron, his family, his friends, my supporters waiting. He, you just did doing nothing and people waiting because we want to you know give Aaron a good send off because he didn't deserve to go but you just don't care but as I say that is what I posted in my YouTube community that I had bad news and this was the update video and thing so that you know that but yeah Only well, yeah, I just lost food right now, to be honest. To be honest, to be honest. I'm so hurt. I'm just so hurt. I'm just feeling... Mm -mm. You're telling me, this man lied to my mother for a whole month? For a whole month? I won't want to know. And if she didn't go, then he would have still be here. He would have still be up there. I would have still be waiting. So when she went, she told me that Aaron, he couldn't calm down. He had to be cremated. Yeah, he had to be cremated away. That was, that was the hardest news to hear. Knowing you can't even see your sibling for the last time. And all I wanted to say was goodbye. That all I wanted to do. That all I wanted to say was goodbye. 
bye bye Iran. That is all I wanted to. That is what I wanted to say. But I had I had to watch him through a phone screen. I had to, I had to watch him through that, knowing he was going to be cremated. Wow. That shows that people. Mm -mm. It's sad. It really is sad. If I don't know how I feel in there, I just feel like my heart just. I lost somebody that I wanted to have, well, to be with forever, to have a strong relationship, to have a close bond with. I know you telling me that. I don't even know how I feel in. Every day goes by and I just, why good? Why? Like, I appreciate everyone's support. I appreciate everyone's support. All of even know, I appreciate everyone's support. Because if it wasn't for all you, I wouldn't even be making this video. All know I cry. Because it had. Imagine losing your only sibling. Your only sibling. Your only sibling. It doesn't matter how sick he was, he was the best brother I could have asked for. I know he gone now and he would want the best for me, but it's hard. It's hard and I just feel like I need to talk it out. If I keep letting my emotions eat me out, then it really is hard. It is hard. And to ever and to the person that do it, why boy, why? Why you run do you so bad that you had to kill him? What? <sighs> I know all you're watching this video right now, I know they like, boy, pray. Just get better for we please, I'm not trying. I really trying. This pain every day I feel in. I just wanna I just wanna get better. I really want to get better. But my mommy is going to keep a service for him. Which should either be this weekend or next week. So I will keep all you updated and I want everybody to come. I want everybody to come and I want everybody to you know just I just want to see my supporters and I just want to give all a hug and I just want you know I just want them to give up I just want to give my brother a really excellent send off even though his body not there even though we have the even though the ashes will be there I don't care you have to get an amazing send off because he was so happy he was just the I remember when I posted the update on my brother which was three weeks ago and I was so I was so happy because he would not come down then he was like then to hear he couldn't come down because his condition was horrible he looked horrible it didn't even look like a run which was sad but as I said God don't sleep God do not sleep. God don't sleep. All the God don't sleep. And it was really hard for me. Trying not to cry is really hard. It's really hard. But I'll be strong for all yeah? And I'll keep all you. Yeah? And I'll let all you know when is the um, service for him. And yeah, that was the update. I just, only I just lost for words. I am lost for words and I just going to try my best. I just, I have to be, I have to be good for him because he would want the best for me. So, this is all I came to say. All I will stay tuned for another video, I guess. I love you all so much. Keep praying to God and stay tuned and I guess, yeah. Bye, guys.